an exciting day here. We got our order from Golf Cart King a little while ago, and I did get some rocker moldings, and I did get a rocks six, or excuse me, four inch lift kit. The lift kit, I think we made this order on Tuesday. The lift was here on Thursday. Um, and then the wheels, these, these are the mods wheels that I ordered, mod seat covers that hopefully match pretty close. And again, these are some aftermarket rockers. So give me a second, I'll get some of this unboxed and we'll take a peek. Those are the black lug nuts. I'm not sure what this is yet. Oh yeah, those are gonna be cool. I like them. Very cool. Let me get the uh, seat box open. All right, so these are the same seat covers I did on my other precedent, sitting right there. Um, I was hoping it'd be a little bit of a closer match, but by the time we get it onto the white body, and that'll probably be appropriate, right? I think so. I think that'll be cool. I don't know, I'm tempted to put these on the, the burgundy one just to see what it would look like with them on there. Hmm. Let me go ahead and do that real quick. All right, I couldn't help myself. I love it, but it's not that I have to switch the seats, right? Hmm. All right, we had a family meeting. I got three women living with me, two daughters and uh, my wife. They all want me to leave the GTX wheels that I have on this. So I guess the GTX bronze are staying, or GTW, excuse me. So we'll leave those for now. At least we'll try until I get this thing built. So I found out that other yellow, the little white bag is these little, I didn't even see these in the picture when I bought it, but those are, those are neat. They just screw in. Here, we'll do one on this front one over here. Just got to tighten them down. So it comes without these installed, I guess, because they stick out. So when the wheels are laying up against one another, they don't want to bend them. So you just put those guys back in and snug them down. Hmm. It's a nice looking wheel. I like the tire. Looks a lot different than the other one. So a little bit different of a look. I think in my video about this precedent, I did say that those tires are loud. I would imagine those would be equally as loud, but hey, I haven't given you guys an update about the one that we're in the middle of building. Um, obviously I've come a little bit away from the last video, put a lot of it back together. You've got a lot of the plastics done. Um, talked a little bit about spraying it. I did spray the dash panel last video. We saw that that was kind of bleached out. I did take the 12 inch steering wheel off of this one. Um, and I bought a 13 inch steering wheel for this one. So a little bit larger. And uh, this one I definitely intend on selling. So um, the light kit on this is a little bit different as well. The on off is right here, which is pretty neat. It's got, so you got a little driving light and then when you do full turn, that's when you get your headlight. It does have signals, it does have hazards. It's got the horn, the hazard button is out here. Um, so this will be a street legal as far as lights are concerned. So put that whole kit. I've seen a lot of folks on club car precedent forums talk about confusion with the uh, brake light. So we'll get that mat up in a little bit and talk a little bit about how that gets wired in because definitely seen it on a lot of the forums so maybe we'll talk about that some uh first time seeing the seat that i had on this cart so again 
we'll be doing these mod seat covers. I'll do a little fix up on the foam there and we'll recover them. I'll do a video on that in the near future. Um, all the body is painted, that rear bucket painted. The, I don't have this on yet. I did clean up the motor a little bit, so everything underneath it has been cleaned up. And that's pretty much where we're at. So in that last video, I talked about how you can see all this. So all these plastics are all nice and fresh and neat. Everything's all nice and clean. So to get the wheels on this, we're going to have to put the lift on. All right. So now we just took the seat off. So in this one, this is a voltage reducer. Put that up here in the front. It just runs from positive and a negative, um, runs over to the reducer. Then from the reducer, I have power into this fuse panel. So inside this fuse panel, you'll be able to wire however many accessories, 12 volt accessories, because it's only 12 volt in here. So the wire that's coming out of there right now is for the headlight kit. And all of that has to be 12. So, and any other accessory that you want to put on and any other lights um, or other accoutrements, you're going to want to do it at 12. So um, this previous card, I did a, a full fuse panel. So you have each individual one. I don't have to have a bunch of different lines with it, its own individual fuse on each line. That way you just go to the panel and we're done. I do have these old Trojans back in it. These are from 13, believe it or not. Somehow they still work. They don't hold a charge for very long and upgrade on this will come soon for this one. Um, so yeah, the rest of it was just bolting the plastics back on. I am still waiting for the body. It's being painted at a body shop. So we're having that painted white. So I'm hoping the white body, the bronze seats, which again, I wish the seat covers were a little bit closer, but so much for that. I think it'll be fine. I think when we get this together, it's gonna be good. Um, rockers, so rockers, I got the rockers. So, when you put these up on the cart, you'll see a difference. And this is why I have to paint them. Thanks. So shine is a little bit different. So I'll spray a light mist of the texture and then I'll use that bumper and trim paint that I showed in my previous video to match everything up because these are a little flatter. So that's why we did that with uh, Ron Burgundy over here. It matches, everything matches. So we'll just do the same thing with this one. Uh, what else for today? I guess that's it. So we'll mess with the lift and we'll do an unboxing of that later. Uh, but that'll probably be our next video, throwing the lift on or doing some seat covers. Thanks for stopping by.